It was clearly that was their target and they intended to harm people inside there. Right now on Eyewitness News at noon, a Jewish market targeted. Officials reveal two shooters planned the deadly attack in Jersey City. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Janelle Burrell. And I'm Jan Carabeo. Jim Donovan is off this noon. The shootout in Jersey City claimed the lives of six people, including a police detective. The incident started around 1230 yesterday afternoon when officers confronted two people they believed looked suspicious. The ensuing standoff lasted hours, bringing a busy neighborhood to a standstill during an intense gun battle. And now police believe the suspects may have been planning an even larger attack. Correspondent Hillary Lane has the latest. After reviewing surveillance videos, Jersey City officials now say two shooters targeted a Jewish kosher deli Tuesday afternoon. We could see the van moving through Jersey City streets slowly. Um, the perpetrator stopped in front of there, calmly opened the door with two long rifles, him and uh, the other perpetrator, and began firing. Two Jersey City officers on patrol just a block away immediately opened fire on the suspects. Heroically placed themselves in the line of fire attempting to give the information and both of them were, received gunshot wounds. Police say the shooting began at a cemetery before shifting to the deli. When it was over, Jersey City Detective Joseph Seals, three bystanders and the suspects were killed. Two wounded officers are expected to recover. Had they not responded and had they not been there in that location, more than likely more people would have died. Schools were locked down for several hours, sending parents into a panic. I got a call from my daughter that she, they told the kids that there was an active shooter in the area and that they were going on lockdown. Based on the amount of ammunition found with the suspects, police believe they intended to kill many more people. Investigators are not commenting on a motive, but the New York Times is reporting one suspect published anti-Semitic and anti-police posts online. The motives are still part of the investigation. I said this location, they exited the van and they proceeded to attack this location. Authorities also found what they describe as an incendiary device in the U-Haul rental van used by the shooters. Hillary Lane, CBS News, Jersey City, New Jersey.